Hello and welcome to Monday Coffee. Today we'll bring you the latest updates from Atlassian World, starting with JSM Asset team needing input from you on audit log features. Then uh, we look at how to apply promo codes in the new billing engine, the ability to finally rename user groups in Confluence, a new customer role for JSM. After, we'll be looking at this week's events followed by the article of the week and we'll end with a couple of partner news. So stay glued to your screens. We'll kick it off right after this quick intro. You're watching the Monday Coffee Show where we bring you the top news and updates from the Atlassian ecosystem in a quick roundup. How quick? Just about long enough for you to enjoy a cup of coffee while learning what's new. We're your hosts, Biro and Nikki from Affire, the leading enterprise collaboration software provider that makes work flow. Before we kick it off, a public service announcement. As mentioned last time, we will be at Team 23 with a special mission. We want to convey the vibe of the team event using Monday Coffee. That way, if you can't attend in person, you will still enjoy the expo, the people network, and get the scoop about useful and interesting sessions happening across the event. Monday Coffee Vegas edition will be packed with a wealth of content like a summary of talks, interviewing guests, and briefing on exciting events. We want you to get the utmost value from our reporting there and, and be part of the event experience with us. So we'll be working tirelessly over Team 23 Week to bring you a full digital program while streaming several times from Vegas. Super exciting. I'm excited about Vegas. I think it's going to be one of our biggest uh, uh, digital experiences ever. The packages with the new tech are arriving every single day. So, <laughs> yeah. You will be the person with the biggest camera in the room. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be very inconspicuous about it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, let's have a look at the first news. It's just a quick announcement about pro providing the feedback. Jira Service Management's asset team wants to hear from you. Atlassian's product manager, Justin King, is prioritizing audit logs for JSM assets and wants your input. So if you have a need for audit logs, help the team understand what you would use them for, who would use them, and whether they impact compliance obligations. You can book available time or reach out directly to him via email, so you can find the uh, link for the uh, where you can book the demo in the post. Who doesn't need audit logs? So everyone should go and give feedback, because audit logs is one of the most request features of everything. Yeah, especially on JSM. Yeah. Right, so Atlassian is launching a new cloud billing engine that will replace the current system used for billing and invoicing. The new engine is designed to improve how users interact with billing and subscription management across all Atlassian cloud products. It offers enhanced uh, flexibility for grouping and paying for sites to better suit business needs. The rollout will take place in phases and will be available for Jira Software, JSM, Jira Work Management, Confluence, Atlas, Compass, Jira Product Discovery, and also the Marketplace. The new engine will not affect current access to sites or product costs and will introduce a new billing administrator super user role for billing permissions within the account. The uh, there's also another update post uh, that's linked to the new billing engine and talking about the promo, the new promo codes area, how it functions and instructions on how to apply promo codes. Have a look at both of these articles. Um, you need to learn about the new system. Do you think that they use Stripe now? Yeah, we do. I think so. You're too big to Stripe, isn't it? That's actually an interesting thing to find out. No, the reason why I'm, I'm, I'm sat here kind of like um, thinking about it uh, is because I think I remember some conversations. Yeah. I don't want to say anything that's not we valid. We should but... research it mm. and let's do the um, Espresso Monday Coffee edition. 
for this. It's called Monday Coffee Unofficial. Okay. I like the espresso version. <laughs> Thank you, Andy. <laughs> Anyways, let's let's have a look at on this week's updates uh, to the Atlassian product. Atlassian customers can finally rename user groups after almost two decades of waiting. A beta version of this feature will be released in late February, allowing group renaming from the group details screen at admin.atlassian.com. However, there are still some limitations. So for example, you can rename special groups, like for example, site admins or synced groups via an IDP. It was 19 years and something for this improvement. But it's really good uh, to see that Atlassian is still delivering on these old feature requests. Like some, some people found it unexpected, but really, really good. And, and uh, um, I'm not gonna comment on that 19 years. <laughs> okay, let's move on. <laughs> I think I'm going to have some feature requests for 19 years in my backlog. It happens to everyone. Uh, Atlassian has introduced a new role for internal customers in Jira service management. This role allows administrators to control who should and who should not be customer for any given JSM help center. Administrators can set the appropriate role for new and existing users, which are agent, customer, or none. The new customer role will preserve the permissions that are the historical to the non role, and existing customers with the non role will be migrated to the new customer role. The new role will be introduced in the coming upcoming weeks, and users will continue to have the exactly same JSM experience as they have today. So no real action needed there. Yeah, I mean, I, I do feel like the customer permissions on JSM needs a lot of evolution especially nowadays with ITSM becoming such a hot topic and more and uh, more and more teams um, are coming to JSM so yeah I think that's this is a good good sign good change right am I next you are next and we have a weekly Atlassian news roundup right do we do we well in this week's events we have a few interesting webinars organized by Atlassian partners ITIL 4 plus Atlassian equals high velocity. This is a webinar by Avant happening tomorrow, is discussing the role of Jira Service Management Conference and Opgini in the achieving high velocity in ITSM. Tomorrow, catch tips for cloud migration webinar by Technofor covering how to migrate to Jira Service Management Cloud and how to take advantage of process mining to optimize processes. There's also the Effective Portfolio Management with Jira Align webinar by Efficode, focusing on the challenges of portfolio management and how to overcome them for portfolio effectiveness. We also have plenty of Atlassian community events happening and to highlight a few, Path to Agile Coaching, this virtual event in Colombo will cover the fundamentals of Agile Coaching and career building for aspiring Agile coaches. Tomorrow, join an in-person event in Palm Beach County in US. Attendees can relax and discuss upcoming 2023 events with Fabian, Chris, and Diana at the Waterway Cafe. A lot more interesting events, so make sure you check out the Goosely calendar, as always. I wish to go to the Palm Beach. <laughs> we'll I've... talk to Fabian. <laughs> okay, I will. Uh, well, let's have a look at the article of the week. This time, it's a popular big topic about AI and making peace with bots. Emerging AI tools like OpenAI's ChatGPT and DALI are already disrupt, uh, disrupting knowledge workers' jobs. Specialized, ideas-driven jobs are still safe, but probably uh, better paid, better educated workers might have the most exposures to AI and could be most at threat to become redundant as the high tech tools become more and more widely available. But human input is still necessary to verify information and supervise AI systems to avoid subtle mistakes. So as long as organizations adopt a growth mindset and embrace new technologies, including bots and AI, uh, it can be a good competitive advantage and can free up organizations to pursue bigger and more ambitious goals. So just to sum it up, there is no reason to be scared that AI is going to replace you. It's more likely that it will be people who adopt AI to deliver the value fast. Agree or disagree? AI is taking over. <laughs> no, no. AI is taking our job. <laughs> it is God not. Damn it. It's gonna help you. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm, I'm fine with it. Okay. 
<laughs> right, now entering the partner newsroom with an update from our friends at Aptis. Their popular app Epic Sum Up has released a new major version, Epic Sum Up 4.0, which includes an improved UI, new onboarding, and new features such as easy navigation for Jira hierarchies and issue creation from detail view editor for easier project planning. I also want to highlight this event in Dubai focused on creating high velocity ITSM using JSM with a guest speaker from AppsVio team. On March 1st, the AppsVio team will provide insights on uh, needs and pain points from the perspective of both agents and customers and share practical tips based on their experience and expertise. Participants will learn how to expedite the ticketing process, provide thoughtful and effective customer service, and look after their agents while saving time. So check out the event. And that's it for Partner News. Another ITSM event. I have a feeling that the system is full of ITSM now. Uh -huh. You should get into it a little bit more, isn't it? Yeah. ITSM. No more Jira software, ITSM. ITSM. <laughs> well, thank you so much for uh, taking your time and uh, watching the Atlassian News Roundup and Monday Coffee with Appfire. Uh, to make sure that you don't miss on the latest and greatest news, make sure that you subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on LinkedIn, still under Jaxo, uh, main account. And we hope to see you in the next one. We'll see you soon. And uh, more comes on uh, uh, Monday Coffee Vegas edition as we progress towards the date. See you soon. Bye.